Hey Cancers, this is Diana for Three Height Priestess. This is your daily reading for 24th through the 26th. Let's see what message they have for you here. How many cards for Cancer? 24th through the 26th. The perfection of life. We'll see what they're talking about here. You're being told here, Cancers, all is unfolding according to a perfect higher order so no one's gonna stop this change okay this beautifulness that you're bestowing on everyone okay it's clear okay that is happening they're saying that things are being cleared out for you to shine and it's not going to make other people happy um it may ruffle their feathers and make them change okay <clears throat> you're being told here cancer that you haven't been forgotten, rejected, or denied by the creator, okay? The storm that needs to erupt is inside of your own heart. We'll see what you look like here for the next few days. Excuse me for all of that coughing and shit that I just did. I was rude, but it's cold. It's got me. This Wisconsin weather is crazy. How many cars for cancer? How is cancer looking? They're like, you got options. I see the seven of cups there. Okay. But there's a sense that you also need to make a decision. Um, and a realistic one. Don't fantasize about things with the seven of pentacles. Let your intuition guide you. Okay. Yes. You have... They're showing you as a knight of pentacles here, okay? So they want you to give out the highest energy um, that you can give at this time. Remain optimistic, okay? Uh, be a good friend. Be faithful. Be true. Um, I feel like this energy will be given back to you. You'll see it in return. You'll see these relationships start to develop and come in towards you here. Okay, what's crossing you is that you've been through some crap. You have everything is fine. The Ten of Swords here. So they're saying you have ended um, some pain, some hurt. Uh, some of my cancers have gone through a lot of healing. You've done a lot of healing work. Um, and it's time for you to somewhat let love in. That's what I'm hearing what you're thinking about or what can happen. Look at that. The best thing is for you to leave the past in the past and let things be, okay? You have everything is fine and the 10 of swords is there twice. Letting old relationships and connections go and allowing new ones to come in. Yes, that's what I'm feeling. It's almost like you're putting into petty arguments or conflicts with the swords here as well. Things that may disrupt your mind and disrupt your peace, okay? You're only allowing good connections that come in. The energy that you put out, you're only accepting that energy back here. That What's the reading for? The will of fortune, okay? This is on your mind. They're saying don't turn back to old ways. Don't turn back to old habits. Don't turn back to old people. You're going to have a reoccurring problem. Okay? You're going to have this shit happen again. That's what it is. Okay? In the past here, that's because they're not telling you the truth. You have the moon card here. And you couldn't be yourself with these people anyway. They were being fake. Okay? Um, they weren't showing their true colors with the moon card here this is something that you realize here in the past future actions you have the magician card um still be careful of these people wanting to follow you follow you and give you <clears throat> love offers still you still got some snakes in the grass they're still the same 
with the magician card here in reverse. They're the same type of people. That's why I keep saying it's going to happen again. The Wheel of Fortune doesn't allow, uh, doesn't bring in change. Whew, that card. You, this is how you're looking. <laughs> Ace of Pentacles. Didn't I say you was a sh Yes, you are. Cancer. All right, believe it. Ace of Pentacles. Look at the new opportunities that's coming towards you here. They're so shiny. It feels good. You should feel fortunate here in the next few days. You're going to get... Um, I feel good news come in as well. Look at that. Some love offers are coming in. People, they're like, hey, what you doing? What you're up to? You have the Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles here. Okay, your hopes and fears is that you'll make a move. You'll bust a move on these love offers here. <laughs> you have the Knight of uh, Wands here in reverse. Okay, your fears here is that you don't bring in these same the same crowd. Uh, late that's the word it's giving me lazy uh unstable um just reckless in their actions players manipulators liars i hate to throw all those words out but you got the moon card and the magician card that's someone that likes to play games and like to trick you okay in the near future they're still gonna be there so careful of the offers that you bring in um, or the ones that you accept here, you're going to have a lot come in towards you. Some of them are going to be serious, okay? Like the Knight of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles. You may have some immature behavior um, or someone is immature um, in the relationship or the connection here. Let's see here, Cancer. Would you please get out your damn car and go get them instead of honking like that? That's ridiculous. That's laziness here, Cancer. For fuck's sake. How things play out with Cancer and in love. Let me get these cards right. One more time. This three of wands. You're going to move forward to a new lover someone that you feel more connected with with the lovers unreal with the lovers card here you're looking at someone else oh you got somebody new coming in here gemini or a fire sign that is here aries leo sagittarius give me cards for cancer please how things play out in love with all these love offers coming in. Okay. Woo! We have the ace of pentacles. So careful of the love offers coming in. Careful. Examine what that shiny coin is looking like. Okay. Because it may just be brass and not gold. Okay. Let's take a look here. cards for cancer why is the ace of pentacles here in reverse photograph <laughs> look at your photographs looking at your photographs missing you um nostalgia make new memories like i said you let someone go here especially in the past with the moon card here they're still watching you thinking about you just may come back around with a love you know with a little flirting little interest and you're like no <laughs> there's it's dead here so that, that lover's card we saw may be someone new like i said here okay if you're dealing with a child here cancer new cards for Cancer. There's something going on with this. You have the world card here. <laughs> and reverse. There's some delays or some issue going on with the world card. I feel like it's connected with the Wheel of Fortune here as well. Some bad luck or some disconnection with the child. 
or some delay in development here. Let's take a look at this. Ooh, these are, this is not what I want here. Why is a world card here for Cancer? It's a long journey. Okay, to get something fixed, not. You have the Ten of Pentacles here. Some of you guys are waiting for adoption papers. There's a delay. Um, that's the energy that's coming in here. There's also this sense of uh, developmental issues as well, or something that's happening in the bloodline. It's a, a, a history in your family bloodline it has something to do with this child as well. And delay in development. That's what I'm hearing here. You fuck, are you kidding me? If cancer is, um, Dealing with a grandchild, how would this play out with the grandchild? One more time. Whew. You have the Eight of Cups here. Careful of this grandchild leaving in the night. Um, there may be a relocation or a grandchild even coming in from a situation into your household. That's what I'm feeling here. This will be in the night from something that is happening to, yeah, that's what I'm feeling. Something that's happening with this this uh, uh, grandchild. It's got me stuttering here. You may have them living with you or residing with you. If you are dealing with a family member here, Cancer, how things play out with the family member. No, they're not very truthful either. You have the higher fit card here. You may get some bad advice from this family member. They think they know what they're talking about, but be very, take what they're saying with a grain of salt. That's what I'm hearing here. If you're dealing with a co worker here, Cancer, how things play out with a co worker? Okay. You have the Ten of Pentacles here. You're going to have a long lasting relationship with this co worker. You're going to gain some in money as well. Something with money with the Pentacles here. You're going to, I feel like some of my cancers are building something. Um,. It has something to do with education here. But it's going to bring in a lot of resources for you both here, okay? If you're dealing with a friend, you have the five of pentacles here in reverse. You may have a friend coming and move with you um, or you're helping them during this time because they're having a rough time. That's what I'm feeling here, okay? Trying to help them out of the trenches a little bit. If you're dealing with an enemy here, Cancer. Ooh, separation. You have the three of swords here. You are still um, moving on from conflict and drama that you may have had with this enemy. It may be a lover because someone cheated on you and they became quickly an enemy to you, okay? Lies and deceptions here. So it's going to remain that way, okay? That is your reading, Cancer, for the 24th through the 26th. Thank you guys for coming back to watch your reading. I do appreciate it. Make sure you like, subscribe, and share this video for me. Hit the notification bell. Hit the like button. That helps me. Yes, I appreciate it. Take care of yourself. Bye.